500 years ago on the west coast of Vancouver Island where I'm from, we never would have needed tribal parks. We, we, we wouldn't need IPCAs. And so I want Canadians to understand that tribal parks, indigenous protected and conserved areas is an olive branch from the elder societies of this part of the world. Um, 500 years ago, if, uh, if somebody proposed to the elders that we should create one, one island in our, er in our territory as a tribal park, it would be a very, um, it would be a very strange proposition because from a Nuchanov perspective, he shook Ishtzawak, you know, everything is one and everything is interconnected, um, means that we understand that one island is not more important than a lake or a, another mountainscape or an inlet uh, or, you know, or a peninsula. He shook Ishtzawak means that all of these things are interconnected and we have to have a balanced, holistic relationship with the whole. And that doesn't mean that we're tree huggers or environmentalists. Um, you know, the reality is, is that uh, indigenous peoples uh, have always utilized natural resources from our territories, but we had a very different way of doing it. And from, from a new channel perspective and with many of the indigenous peoples that I work with across Canada, this is about creating a more resilient Canadian economy that is truly in the best interests of all Canadians.